Now, the DA wants the finance minister to fire his economic advisor, Professor Chris Madigane. The DA says he is suggesting that people take arms uh, to achieve radical economic transformation. Terming Madigane's appointment reckless, DA says it will question Malusi Gigaba over it in the next session of Parliament. Two weeks ago, the Minister of Finance, Malusi Gigaba, distanced himself from the mad ideas being uh, put forward by his economic advisor. Uh, but since then, uh, his economic advisor has, of course, said uh, that the minister can't tell him to keep his mouth shut. But we think he's now crossed a red line in uh, our constitutional democracy, uh, where it was, uh, because it has been reported, uh, that he seemed to suggest that uh, people take up arms. Uh, in order to achieve radical economic transformation. If the economic advisors' policies were implemented and that the banks, the mines and insurance companies were nationalized, we would essentially turn South Africa into Venezuela. The bottom line is the kinds of statements being made are exactly the kinds of reckless statements which are going to discourage private sector investment uh, and undermine investor confidence. And now it looks like a case of deliberate misreading of the statement on the DA's part. Here's what Madigane actually said on the matter. Making a case for constitutional amendments for effecting transformation, he said we need a two-thirds majority to change the constitution. He said that an absence of constitutional path to achieve what we want to achieve, we need to go that route. Implying taking up arms, he said taking up arms is one thing, but building a country is another. And clearly denouncing violence, he said, let's try two-thirds. I don't like war. There is a pushback from what indeed is white monopoly capital from the radical economic transformation ideas that uh, people like uh, Professor Chris Malikani are advocating. It is completely not true that uh, he ever suggested that uh, people should take up arms. In fact, the person who made that suggestion was in the audience who left immediately after having made such suggestions to imply, therefore, that that person who was in the audience who left immediately thereafter had one intention and one intention alone to really impugn the character of Professor Chris Malikani.